one of my favorite things is the little kind of a flirtation, kind of an interest between Ben and Leslie. Yes. Is that something that gets explored throughout the end of the season? Indeed it does, yes. Is there a chance that Dave might come back and throw a wrench into that plot? Um, Dave does not come back okay. this season uh, because Louis C.K. is busy being the greatest living stand-up comedian in the world. So we focus um, on Ben and it's Leslie. It's really about Ben and Leslie, yeah. Okay. And it's a very slow burn that takes up the entire season. Do they ever get to go on a first date? I don't think I want to spoil that. Okay, okay. Yes or no, I'm not going to say it. And Leslie obviously has some odd choices about what she thinks is sexy and romantic. Yes. Where does that come from? Well, I think that, um, and I mean this in the best possible way, I think that, that Leslie's a little bit of a nerd. And I think that is part of what's endearing to Ben about her. Mm -hmm. And I think that Ben is a little bit of a nerd, which is maybe what's endearing to Leslie about him. Right. And, um, you know, she's a, a very self-possessed, intelligent woman who is really good at her job and is very vibrant and vivacious. And I don't think she particularly cares that much about being cool. Right. It's more just like, so because of that, like, she, she wants to dress for what she imagines her job will be in the future in, in a kind of professional way. But she's more like giddy than cool, I would say. I actually met in the writer's room who... who oh, <laughs> sorry. Uh, That's okay, I like your answer. But I, I don't mean, know, I, I, that, was part of the, that was part of the DNA of the character okay. from the very beginning, the beginning, I think, was that she wasn't like... She was never going to be like the, in super fashionable clothes and like right. out on the town. You know? Right. It might. Do we see them on a date? We might, but if something like that were to happen, it would be more accidental. Okay. Okay. Than on purpose. And would you think? Would you say that now you guys you're not quite enemies anymore? You're coming around to each other. Frenemies. That's a good one. Is that good? That's a good yeah, one. That I think that works for Leslie. And okay. Great. If you are a fan of the two of them together, you're going to be very happy with the things you see this season. They're starting to get to know each other. Ben is no longer a, an, an enemy becoming an ally, but we don't know, will he stay, will he stay in this small town, you know, will, uh, Leslie's always focused on her career, will she pay attention to her personal life? Tune in. <laughs>